You're new here. Stranger, huh? <laughs> yeah, you do look pretty strange. Welcome to Wellspring, stranger. Best little town this side of what passes for civilization and a few good safe miles from any authority outposts. Nicest people you'll ever find live right here. Friendly folk. Not your wasteland bandit scum. Good honest people. Well, enough with all that. So I hear you have a message from our friend Dan. Let's have it then. Having some trouble with bandits in the settlement again. Dangerous life out there. Deadly even. Well, I can get all this stuff he needs. Gonna take some time though. Not sure how long. He must really respect you to give you this important job. So for now, I'll trust you too. You can stay here in Wellspring while I'll get his supplies, but not dressed like that. You'll bring the authority sniffing around, and I sure don't need that. So, you'll need to lose the Ark suit for something a bit more modern. <laughs> Go see the vendor in town. Get some new clothes. I don't care what you do with that suit, as long as no one sees you in it again. You blend in, understand? Good. Glad we understand each other. When you come back, we can have another little chat. Sure I saw them. Mutants, ten, twenty of them. All over that valley. I had a hold of someone, just ripping them apart. That's why you'll never catch me leaving here. Never. Here the mutants are spreading into the settlements, damn things. Soon they'll be busting down the town gates. Listen, you ever spot a mutant, you kill it quick. Those things are only trouble. Take my advice, stranger. Keep a low profile around here. You start attracting too much attention, and next thing you know, authority will be wanting to talk with you. And you don't want that. Haven't seen anyone dressed like that in a long time. People always going missing, and I don't think mutants are getting them either. Something else is going on. Watch yourself. We've always got space for new races! Hey, my friend. I must say, you do look like a racer if ever I saw one. Why not try your luck on the track and earn some racing certificates? Trust me, they can be mighty useful. You new in town? Well, I got everything you need to keep your vehicle working, right? Now listen, I only take racing certificates for any upgrades or parts, and you gotta win those on the racetrack, nothing else. So if you wanna deal with me, you best see Jackie Weeks first. 
He's always on the lookout for new racers. Greetings. Name's Jackie Weeks, and I'm the Empresario who runs all the high-speed races in Wellspring. And I do mean all. If you're interested in testing your skill, you can go talk to my business associate over there, Slim. He can get you all set up to race. And do come back if you feel the need for some speed. Racing is the one thing people still got that's entertaining. You win some races and people around town will look mighty favorable towards you. We've always got exciting events open. Go talk with Slim in the booth, see what he has running. stranger <laughs> you look like a racer to me hey you ready to try and win some racing certificates welcome friend name's Carl but seems like everyone calls me slim <laughs> funny huh all right the deal is if you want to race you talk to me now just take a look at all the events we have here find something you like and assuming you meet the requirements then you're in all the prizes aren't racing certificates, you know. Good to get new vehicle upgrades at Rusty's. <laughs> well, everyone needs those. Interested in winning some racing certificates? Drive safe. Welcome, race fans, to another exciting Dusty 8 event. Care to look through the list of events? See you again! Look no further than here for all your vehicle needs. 
Care to browse my selections? Drive like you mean it, friend. Will you look at how you're dressed? I haven't seen anyone wearing an arc suit for a long time. Dangerous thing you're doing there. Be careful. Authority spots you and you'll be hauled away in a flash. You best keep as low a profile as you can around here. Don't let people know you're from the past. Rewards are large for turning one of you in. But lucky for you, I hate the authority more than I need money. from the past walks through my door and goes to show you that no one needs nothing around here. But let's first talk about that suit you're wearing. I can take it off your hands for a fair trade and get you something uh, a little less, well, noticeable. Each of the suits possesses unique characteristics. It's up to you to decide what works best for you. sell all manner of goods here. I have some of the finest goods.
Good day to you. That's much better. Now you look like any other good, hard-working citizen. But we got another problem. You see, you can't just leave your vehicles parked outside my town. We're civilized here. We have rules. And since it looks like you're gonna be here a while, you're gonna need a place to park your stuff. Go see Mick across the way in the garage. He can help you. Got that? After you talk to Mick, go see Sheriff Black. He should have Dan's supplies all set by then. <laughs> You're gonna like our Sheriff. Territory. Remember, working together benefits every citizen and makes this town stronger. Thank you for your attention. Congrats on the race. I got the best vehicle parts anywhere. Didn't the authorities say it so had stabilized you're the cost the of water? Up. Some new t Well, if it isn't a stranger from nowhere, care to try your luck at a game of cards? As your mayor, it is my responsibility to ensure commerce and trade flow freely in town. Unfortunately, there have been reports of price gouging, hoarding, and unfair business. all work together to make it stronger and more attractive to outside traders and travelers. Well, well, well. How did it do to you? And what can Mick do for you? Oh, a garage? Well, you've come to the right place. So here's the deal. Fairest in the wasteland. You let me do all the repairs on your vehicles and guess what? That covers the rent for the space. What a deal. And I see you got one of them shortwave radios. 
Mighty handy here, mighty handy indeed. So if you get into a jam and need a tow, why, just get on the radio and give me a blast. <laughs> How's that for service? And that door there will get you into your garage. Or just drive up to the main gate outside and I'll let you in. Couldn't be any easier. And lastly, welcome to town. Attention all citizens. Sheriff Black has reported a sharp increase in bandit activity north of the city. Please restrict all non-emergency travel and Jack is once closed. safe again. Thank you for your understanding. There's always some fool willing to risk his money just to take a little of yours. If you find yourself low on cash, these games are a great way to make a little extra. Let me guess, you're the stranger that Clayton says is taking some stuff to Dan's place. Now, I'm afraid it isn't gonna happen quite so easily as that. No way I'm sending all these supplies with you in an unarmed buggy. Might as well dump the damn stuff on the road. What you gotta do here is see Rusty by the track entrance. He can get you all set up with some guns, you got it? Get some firepower, then you can come back and take the supply. Hello. Hello. Excuse me. 